sleep for young Crispin, no rest from his dread as he sat on the edge of the comfort of bed. A soft voice came a murmuring in from the cold. The attic, young Crispin, come forth and behold. So, young Crispin tiptoeing to not make a sound lest he startle the ghosts that were lurking around and doing ghost business, for so it is said that life can be busy when one is undead. Yes, silent as snow did the little lad go to the door that he thought, but he didn't quite know. When he pulled on the handle and heard it release, he whispered quite quietly, I come in peace. At first one step, then two step, and then three, and then four, as his ears smelt the wind of the fast shutting door. <laughs> 